built in 1938. It was placed in front of the admin building, and you, I show you, I can show you pictures of where it was and the flight plan. It was moved here because of an accident. A bulldozer came and hit it when it was over there, and they decided to place it somewhere else while they continued with the work with the bulldozer. The bulldozer was here for demolition. It almost demolished this, but this is pretty solid. We've tried to lift it up a couple of times so that we could go ahead and replumb because people have broken off the handle, but we capped the drain. But only seniors could drink from this. And the story was they would go get freshmen that misbehaved and give them a toothbrush and they would clean the white part of it. And they said they would have them brush their teeth with the dirty toothbrush. It's a story. I don't know. I, I wasn't here. So they rebuilt it again, trying to get it to work. You can see it here. In the, in the night was 86 when they put it back in its glory. And that would have been put a new faucet, make sure the drain works. But um, over the years, someone has, has heard it even more. So we're talking about taking this device and this is going to be our uh, time capsule. And we're going to move it. We're going to move it and then we're going to be work, putting stuff below it. Not in it, but actually below it, underground. And we're hoping for 50 to 100 years before somebody opens it up to see what's in there. But if I'm still here, it's going to be things about Colton High School. Maybe a couple of things. Maybe the election. But I want Colton High School stuff in here. So those records, by the way, that was in that one, was Elvis Presley. Have you ever heard of them? Yeah. <laughs> okay, they were his records, 45s.